Hey YouTube, it's me Stephanie coming to you with a haul. I got a few things from Bloomingdale's. Yeah, um, NARS had a, I think some other cosmetic lines as well, but they had a 20% off promotion, so I took advantage of that. Um, I picked out a couple of things for myself and my boyfriend. I picked out one thing for myself that I really wanted. Boyfriend got the rest of it, so he's a sweetheart for doing that. Love you, Russell. Anyway, um, what I got was something that is like so old to everybody else, but I had a sample of it, or I tried it before, and I loved it, and I never got a chance to um, purchase it, and it's the NARS Blush in Super Orgasm. Yep, yep, yep. Got that. That's what it looks like with the cover. I'm going to take the little plastic thing off. Let's see if I can get a close up. Kind of hard to focus. It's very pretty. Very shimmery. A peachy color. Yeah, really shimmery peachy color. It's almost, I would say it was almost a peachy color with flecks of like sand, like beachy peach, beachy peachy. That's what it should have been called anyway. But yep, love super orgasm. And it's funny, I'm doing a makeup haul of these cosmetics and I have not a stitch of makeup on my face. Sue me. I worked 10 and a half hours today. So we just winging it. The next thing I got was this, and this is the NARS um, Duo Eyeshadow in Rated R, and the colors are gorgeous. Um, here's with the little piece, so I'm going to take that off, you can see the colors, very pretty really pretty blue and a green can't wait to do a makeup look with that then another thing that I picked out are those are the first two well these this is the third thing that I picked out that he um, got for me and it's a lip gloss very pretty in color and the name of this one is Angelica I don't even think that'll focus in, but we'll try. And it's really pretty pink color. I'll swatch it on my hand. Really pretty. And my two bonuses were another eyeshadow compact the name of this one is heaven and it's a very pretty orangey one is an orangey color let me get the paper off one's orange and one's like a really really pale pink like a ballerina pink very pretty colors great neutral especially if you just want to do you know what this would be really pretty I have this other lipstick and if I can find it real quick I'll put on here but um it'll be, be really pretty if you want to do a bold tangerine lip and then use those two as your colors on your eyes yep very pretty and then last but not least um this particular one is a lip gloss but it's a lip stain lip gloss and it's a really pretty chocolate color and it is victory i'll put it on my hand and i'm thinking it'll be better it's so pigmented it's ridiculous like you put on a one fell swoop and that's your color and I was thinking okay being that I'm light complected I don't didn't think this was gonna work for me but I'm thinking if I pair it with maybe a shimmery 
sandy color that would be pretty with it or just put this on extremely extremely lightly and put maybe a peachy color in the middle of your lip I think that would be pretty so we shall see but those are the things that I got from Moomingdale's thank you to my boyfriend who spoiled me this weekend for no reason love that what else well while I'm doing the blooming I'm also well show you a couple of other things that I got the tangerine color I was talking about was the wet and wild mega shield lip color and the color on this one is Sasa Lessons. This camera is a mess. It focuses for a hot second. And excuse the condition of it because it opened and got over everything. But it's a really gorgeous tangerine color. Really pretty. So that's the color I was saying with the go with that NARS shadow. Really pretty. And then I got that one from CVS. It was like two dollars maybe. Got that, and that's from Wet and Wild. And then I got um my girl Aaliyah. Aaliyah Fashionista, Fashionista Aaliyah. She put me on to the Maybelline Long Lasting Stains, Glosses, and the uh, Lipsticks. So I end up getting, I think I'm going to get the 24 hour one, which is the lip stain with the gloss, the dual step lip treatment thing on the Um, I think I'm going to try that. But I end up trying this because I love a fuchsia lip, but the, with fuchsia lips on me for some reason, the color never stays on. Um, I end up getting... Super Stay 10 Stain Gloss and the color is it is so hard it's a fuchsia color fresh fuchsia and I couldn't even zoom in I can barely read it and I have glasses on it's tiny on here but this is what the container looks like and when you open it a little wand like that and it's a really pretty fuchsia color. Gonna do a swatch, I guess, right here. And if you're following me on Instagram, you probably saw this already because I was so excited. I love it. But it's that one right there. Really pretty fuchsia color. It's coming off maybe a little orange or mauvey orange on here, but it's fuchsia, definitely. Um, what else? Yeah. I think that's the only thing I've bought recently cosmetic. No, I haven't. I got this Milani sheer cover concealer stick and the color is a one medium. Hello, focus whatever oh one medium take my word for it um I got oh I like this one too the Maybelline dream bouncy blush it is so pretty open it for you open 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 look how pretty that is I'm swatching this one too I am running out of hand y'all let's see and when you touch it to put it on, I swear it feels like a trampoline is bouncy. Okay. See that color? Isn't that pretty? Woo pretty. Okay. Trying to hurry up. Um I also got this. It's the Wet and Wild Ultimate Minerals Bronzer. And it comes in a little jar like that. You can almost see the pigmentation in the jar. But it's a really pretty. Let's see if I can get this 
awesome uh, it opens up like that and then it has another flip top and you could take that off the sticker off and use those but I find it stays better like this because the flip top is perforated on top and it goes into the hole so it won't go any everywhere but let's see if I can get it out get a sample sample some if you can see that I give enough see that iridescent look right there let me see if I can get a little more out that's me tapping y'all nobody's trying to break down the door But anyway, it's a peachy bronze. So, if you have red undertones or you're a woman of color, be careful with it because it can instantly look like you have you picked up the wrong container and put blush all over your face. So, I would stick to that like your temp, like a blush almost. You can put a little bit on your forehead area. A little bit in your like your highlighting places but other than that I wouldn't go overboard with that but it's really pretty really pretty and again that is amber glow 167 ultimate minerals bronzer by wet and wild and I believe thoughts is it yeah that's the base that's basically what I got as far as makeup uh, I'm going to clean myself up and you'll probably see it on the video coming shortly after of me making up my face using a few of these products and just more of a foundation routine so anywho talk to you guys later bye